I got my hair back. I got my limited edition Evan Galen glasses back. If I tell you all that my life's good, and y'all even believe it. <laughs> After three years, I'm finally going to Japan. In 2022, I kind of lost passion for this whole YouTube project. I didn't upload much. Video editing is just not as fun as it used to be. Because I remember the good old days that I have some osu ideas. I would just record the video and then just edit along with the vlogs. 2022, I spent the whole year just staying in this room. What am I supposed to do, you feel me? But now I'm feeling good. <laughs> now I'm feeling good. I have a really good feeling about this trip. And the reason I say trip is because I'm only be staying in Japan for about one month. January 10, all the way until 4th of February. However, even though this is just a short period, I'm gonna be performing for the first time in Tokyo on the 21st and the 22nd of January. If you guys are interested, if you guys are in Tokyo by any chance, please come and visit me. O2 gang <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little nervous because this is my first time performing But hey, just like a Chinese idiom says You will cross the bridge when you get to it Everything is gonna fall into the place at the end Maybe sometimes, you just need to step out from the comfort zone Let me ask you guys a question Think about it, seriously If I never uploaded Fantasy World What do you think is gonna happen to me? I had a lot of days and nights of me just thinking like what if I never got out and start singing? I feel like everyone has different stages in life. For me, I kind of lost the glory days of the Osu, of the Japan vlog days. But at the same time, I kind of shift over to a different stuff. And I am lucky to have that, to have you all supporting me no matter what I do. A question that I got a lot is that I went from Osu YouTuber into the vlog YouTuber and to this hyper pop artist even though I don't make hyper pop anymore. So what's next? Actually, I kind of want to get into fashion. I just need someone to guide me the right way to do more relating stuff towards that direction. And hopefully someone that watched this video is gonna reach me out. If not, it's okay. I learned to take things slowly. Life, I guess. Can't just rush things out. I might do some live stream on Twitch, so make sure to follow my Twitch and my new TikTok. I created a TikTok because everyone in your grandma is playing TikTok. I have to join the TikTok bro, do the dance shit. <laughs> nah, but for real, the most important one, my Instagram. Make sure to follow my Instagram, I'm gonna post so much stuff on my Instagram. I think? Yeah, I probably do. So be sure to follow my Instagram. I'll try to record as many videos as I can and upload them slowly one by one. And of course, if you guys have any video ideas, please let me know in the comment section. So yeah, I just want to say thank you all for sticking with me throughout these three years COVID-19 era. Like without all the Japan stuff, y'all still decided to stick with me. That's how much love y'all been giving me and I just want to say thank you, seriously. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Y'all still watching me. You know, I'm not even making those trending kind of video that most of the people want to see. Y'all are just watching me because of me. And that just means a lot. Like, I don't know, man. I just feel so happy every time I think about it. <laughs> Hope to see you guys in the next video. I'm not sure when I'll see Pochita again. February, yeah. I'm gonna see Pochita in February. See you guys in the next video. I did not record. I did not record. Bro, do it again. You guys do it again. Dude! Don't ever watch it! Dude, you Okay, I'm done. <laughs>